As your company grows, you'll want to add more users to Smileback. This is very simple. The only thing you really have to remember is that new users have to be added by someone who is already logged in to your company account. If users try to add themselves to Smileback, they will not be able to join your company and instead they'll create a new account with only them in it. So make sure you're logged into Smileback as an account administrator and from wherever you are in the app, you can go to the user menu. This is in the top right of the screen where your name is. Click on that and then find the users option. If you cannot see this, you're probably not logged in as an account administrator. So please ask a colleague who does have those permissions. At the bottom of the list, you'll see the button add user. Click on that. You can now enter the details of your new user. Put in their name, their email address, and double check the email address to make sure it's right. Then their job title. Towards the bottom, you'll see these permissions. If you set them as an account administrator, they'll have the ability to add further users and they can also update your account subscription and billing details. Giving them CSA access means that they can see your Smileback reviews. If you enable this, you'll see that there are a few more levels of permissions. Read only means they can see all of the reviews and reports, but they can't update them. The further levels of permissions give them the ability to update options in your account, like creating automation rules or adding notes to reviews. For full details of this, please see the article on our help center titled Understanding User Permissions. When you're ready, just click the submit button. This will send an email to your new user containing a link which they need to click in order to gain access to their new account. And that's all there is to it.